Hi, welcome to One Plus One is Three. I'm Kirsten, and today I'm going to be giving you some cold remedies for when you're pregnant. If you're new to this channel, I am 27 weeks pregnant currently, and I have been suffering with a bit of a cold for the last couple of weeks. I managed to get away with it for a few weeks. Both my children had a cold, and I thought I was doing really well fighting it off. But then I had a couple of nights where I didn't sleep so well, and I think that just left my immune system feeling a little weaker, and unfortunately it gave way to the cold, and I've had had a runny nose, sore throat, just been feeling generally really under the weather. And I know a lot of people have been, especially at this time of year, with the weather getting a little bit colder recently, lots of people are suffering with colds, but unfortunately when you're pregnant, you can't take the usual drugs that you would take when you first come down with a cold to help fight it off. So I thought I'd just make a short video about what I've been taking and how I've been helping myself feel a little bit better um, in hopes that I can help somebody out there who is also pregnant and not sure what they can take or use to make themselves feel better. So the first thing that I can recommend is this dual defense. This one is by Boots. But you can also get one that's um, by the company Vix, and it says it helps stop cold and flu like symptoms, use at the first signs, clinically proven and suitable for use during pregnancy and from one year. It says to use at the first sign of symptoms at least three times a day to help stop cold and flu like symptoms. And what it is, is basically, it's a little spray that you just spray up your nose and apparently it helps to trap the germs and um, stop them from taking over. So that's something you can use in the first instance when you feel a cold coming on. Next, I can recommend um, the good old fashioned honey and lemon. I found a couple of great products which have got it all in one so that you um, can take it out and about with you, which is really helpful. The first one is this Rouse Super Honey. And that actually has um, Monica honey and vitamin C in it. Um, and they're both uh, known to help a lot with colds. And kind of a similar product, um, is these Rouse Pure Honey and Lemon Sachets. And they're not cheap, but they are really useful just to take out and about with you. For example, take them to work with you. And it's just a little sachet. You snap it in half and stir it into hot water and you've got yourself a great honey and lemon drink. So that can soothe your throat and the vitamin C obviously is great for your immune system to help you fight the cold. Again, on the good old fashioned <laughs> vitamin C root, this is a um, pink grapefruit, but oranges, lemons. I went straight to the supermarket when I felt like my cold was coming on and I just bought loads of fruit. Um, when you've got a cold, you kind of feel like eating more anyway, although the kind of stuff you fancy eating is more often kind of comfort food. Other foods that you could eat that could help would be um, some tomato soup. Tomatoes are really high in vitamin C as well, and that's obviously nice and warm and soothing on your throat. And eating healthily is gonna be good for you and your baby anyway. Some other remedies that you could use to help clear blocked sinuses or a uh, blocked nose is that you could um, run some hot water, run the shower for example, and just breathe in the steam. The steam helps to open up your pores and just kind of un unclog things. Also, you could try using um, vapor rubs. There's Vicks or um, Boots do their own brand. I don't actually enjoy using vapor rubs just because I find it leaves your skin feeling really greasy and I find I get a bit spotty on my chest after I've used them. Um, something I did end up using this time actually was um, Olbus oil for children. I went into my children's bedroom and borrowed this from them and just put a few drops on my pillow and I found it really helped at night um, to clear my airways and help me breathe a bit but it was not too strong because obviously it's the one for children. 
something I can recommend if you've got a really sore throat are some glycerin pastels. I know Boots do some really nice black currant ones. They've got no drugs in them, but they're just nice and soothing on your throat if you've got a particularly sore throat. Two other things I can recommend are plenty of rest and plenty of fluids. I took one day off work last week and it made the world of difference. I felt so much better after having just had one day on the sofa, under all my blankets, just resting. And obviously keeping your fluids up is really important, especially in pregnancy, because you really don't want to be dehydrated. And with a runny nose, you're obviously losing quite a lot of fluid, so you need to replace that as well. Just remember that when you're pregnant, you must avoid drugs like aspirin, ibuprofen, and codeine. So your usual cold remedies are probably not going to be safe for you. If you're in doubt, then I can recommend a website. It's called the Bumps website, and it's the best use of medicines in pregnancy. You can find it at www.medicinesinpregnancy.org. I found that quite useful to look up um, which drugs I can and can't take. I do hope you found this video useful. If you did, please click the thumbs up below and do hit subscribe if you want to keep up with all my future videos and don't forget to click the bell so that you're notified every time I upload something. Thanks very much for watching. Bye.